shame. I look sweaty, I'm gonna look a mess because I've been working hard in my studio during this free period. God, I really need to sort the hair out before I teach. Um, and doing a bit of work. That wall is now blank. I'm gonna create a resource wall. And then the stuff that was there I have moved so that they're against that wall. And then I started blacking out these windows at the top uh, because it affects the projector annoyingly. So uh, yeah, that's what I did yesterday with a breakdown of the A-level course. Oh, gone blurry, gone blurry. Why is it gone blurry? Breakdown of the A-level course and the GCSE course. So uh, yeah, I'm quite, uh, quite pleased. But I do look a mess now, that's the only issue. Let's go get lunch and try and sort this out. Alliances are all torn apart. The world's broken. Hello, hello. That's how my day has been going. Um, I had therapy. Um, during which I realised that I am actually incredibly exhausted. And it doesn't matter how fast or slow the speed of work is, it's not about the speed, it's about the content of the job that I'm doing, which is like 90% COVID. So I'm exhausted, but I got a new thing for D and D. So I'm just gonna showcase spell cards, which is nice. So when you can't find fulfillment in work, buy shit. I guess. Uh, yeah, my back is fucking killing me though from being sat all day. And I'm sleepy. So I'm just gonna crash and take this off at long last. I think I have to put a heat pack on my back as well. Because my back really hurts. Do some stretching. Write out some spell cards. Go the fuck to sleep. Tomorrow will be better though. And I have no agenda. It's Sunday on the other hand. I'm gonna be out. And I don't know how much I'll film, as usual these days, because um, I'm going to spend time with the boy. That long fucking last. Hello. It's Saturday. Woohoo. Um, it's funny, I've, I'm getting more into like a routine at nights and stuff, like, I try and stay up a bit later Friday and Saturday to watch shows and because, you know, I should be able to, um, and then I always assume, oh, I might struggle in the mornings and then will that have a knock-on effect, and it may still have a knock-on effect, but I know that, like, this morning, my body was ready to wake up at, like, eight, which is later than normal, of course, but considering I went to bed about two, in the morning, it's pretty good. Um, so, yeah. So I chilled out most of the morning, and then I've just been to look around a house um, that came on for sale last week. That I like the look of, and I really like it. It's really nice, very modern. Wouldn't have to do anything to it, even the garden's been redone, and the garden looks lovely. Um, so yeah, I'm quite optimistic about it. As we're coming out, someone else was going to look in, and you're like, ugh. But, um, you know, it, uh, I'm going to speak to, I'm going to email the, uh, my mortgage person tomorrow and get some figures and stuff, because it obviously changes, it changes daily and stuff. Um, so, and then think a little bit more whether I want to make an offer. 
but that's exciting it's the first time since the house i looked at sort of late last year that i've actually been quite excited about a house so that's good um so now i've got a busy afternoon obviously i did that now i've just come down to my friend's costume shop Jen's costume shop uh just to help her with something quickly so i've got my mask already and everything for that so um to quickly help her with that then i've got to go up to have a meeting um with some people about a filmed production a filmed dance show essentially that we're hoping will stream at one of the big drive-in cinemas that has come to banbury so it's all very exciting because it's very different it's a lot of work but i've said i would help maybe more for me but it'll be an interesting project so busy afternoon and then hopefully a family dinner a bit later and a um you know our usual saturday film nights and stuff which have turned into a bit of a staple especially this lockdown three actually all the lockdown um so yeah it was like a positive day i feel productive today i feel positive which is good hope that continues tomorrow as well So, yeah, got all of my current spells sorted last night with the information on what they do, how they work, written on the back. Do, do, do. This is a inherited trait so the only new spell is alter self and that was when I bumped up to third level and got second level spells with that this one's really cool because alter self does exactly what you'd expect it to do you can change your appearance and the way you sound. Everything about yourself. Within reason. You can't make yourself bigger than you already are. Has to be a creature of the same size. But. There's someone who. Um. Used to be in with the Thieves Guild. Being sneaky doing bad things, being able to change your appearance makes sense. He's still got that on your ear. We were just looking up there because there was a bird. We were all looking. Don't look, he's there. I'm filming this as I'm about to play around with something, um, so <laughs> this might have a really long, awkward end on it, because um, I won't be able to press the stop button as of about now. Um, oh god, it's different. Oh, fuck. Um, so basically, I found out uh, a friend of a friend has overcooked, um, and she's in a group chat that I'm in. And she asked if I wanted to play. I, was, I don't have anything else to do this evening, so I was like, sure. Um, except I don't remember how to play this game anymore. And I am really bad at it. Um, but yeah, so currently we're making 
fajitas, I guess. Oh god, we put the wrong ingredient in. Oh Jesus. Um Yeah, so that's what I'm doing with my evening. I'm I'm feeding tortillas to monsters to stop them from breaking in. I'm trying to talk at the same time. This is how I'm going. Hello. Busy day. As I said earlier, I had all those different meetings, so meeting people about different things. Um, my last meeting went on quite a long time. It was alright, it was good, planning something fun, exciting project. So I only got home about quarter past seven. So me and Dad have just gone out to get fish and chips. But it's very busy, so he insisted on going in, so I'm just sat in the van again. Um, yeah, it's about nearly quarter to eight now. <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> But um, it's been a really nice Saturday. Nothing special about it, really. Apart from a look around the house I might like. But, you know, just one of those days where you sort of go, yeah, life is alright sometimes. Strangely optimistic for me. <laughs>